What's up guys, welcome to another episode of Cooley Outdoors. I'm Jordan Cooley and this is Aaron Jenkins. Howdy. And today we're uh, gonna go out to a little trout pond that's stocked with a bunch of trout. Uh, basically just to build our confidence, the trout's kind of made for little kids. So I think it's kind of cheating. But uh, we just really need a confidence builder in this win midwinter slump we've been having. We haven't been able to catch a lot of fish, so we're gonna go out and hopefully put some rainbow trout on the ice for you. Now we gotta go pick it up off the road. Rescue machine. <laughs> Merry Christmas, buddy. All right, guys, I got one here. Feels like a small one. Crappie. Oh, he got off. <laughs> or did he? Yeah, he did. God. <laughs> Oop, pulled mine away. Oh, he missed his. Yep, pulled mine away. Oh, there's one. There you go. Oh, yeah. There you go. Oh, finally. Finally got one hooked. These trout are very strong. They have really hard, the tops of their mouths are very hard, and it's very hard to get a hook into them. That's why me and Aaron are struggling to actually hook into them. And we don't really, we're not very experienced with catching these things because they're just stocked in here. But they're very fun to catch when you can actually hook into them. Oh, I missed him. Did you? Yep. Got one here. Oh, Aaron's got one. This is going to be a nicer fish. Yellow tungsten with a waxy. Hook in the upper lip. Nice fish, man. That's that little uh, Ratso jig I had on. Stop squirming, buddy. Little tungsten ratso, and he has a bunch of waxies on it. As you can see, I'm fighting to get the hook out of here on this guy. Can't get a hand on him. Very rough top of the mouth. Kind of like a walleye. Really got to get a good hook set. This one was just dead sticking with the waxy on it. He came up and got it. That a boy. one yeah yeah it's about time oh you son of a gun oh. these fish are very tough they're a very tough fish they're pretty much all muscle and even though this guy's like maybe 12 inches they still fight like a son of a gun, but they're very fun to catch. With these trout, they're very pressured. So one thing, most of the time, you're gonna need to use live bait if trout are really pressured. And uh, basically, we're just letting it sit here and just letting the fish come up to it. And I'm marking one right now. See if he bites. There we go. Got another one, yeah. Oh. Got another one, guys. And 
you might notice that these fish are very small but after how we've been doing lately it's just it's a lot of fun you guys are probably like why is he having so much fun catching these things it's it's been pretty slow lately on the lakes that we've been going to and it's just fun actually catching fish me and Aaron today we both probably missed about probably 10 fish each and if you guys have any suggestions on how to get a better hook set on these trout comment that down in the comments below because we're we're definitely not experienced with trout fishing here in South Dakota and we'd like to know how we can catch these fish a little better.